Well, hello. I hope day one is off to a great start. Here it is um, early mid-afternoon. It's not, it's after lunch, but before um, three o'clock. I am just now fixing to have my trim stick. Have you had your trim stick yet? And if so, tell me what flavor you had. Put it in the, in the post or in the chat here. Let me know. I am actually going to drink orange pineapple and I'm going to put a scoop of our pina colada um, collagen in it. Oh my goodness, this is great. Okay, here's a tip right quick before I do it. I take my shaker cups. I know it's a pink one, it's not zingular, but this is what I had. So I've got my pink. I put a little bit of, I'm here at my sink, warm water. It's hard to see. A little bit of warm water. And then I put the um, collagen. Let me get my lid. Sorry about that. And um, I shake that up. So that is going to um, dissolve. Okay, and I'll tell you why I found out it's important to add warm water to your collagen, um, your pina colada flavor when you shake it up. And it is because it has real coconut milk in it. That's what gives it the coconut flavor. It's not an artificial flavor. And as we know, coconut oils, coconut milk, will will um, turn to a solid when it's cold. And um, because I know when I scoop out my, co my coconut oil to cook with and stuff, it's always like a solid. Then when it gets hot, it turns to a liquid. So if you put it in cold water, it's not gonna, it's gonna stay clumpy. It's not gonna dissolve. So I put in a little warm water. Then I will add my orange, um, orange pineapple um, trim stick to it. Add more water, add ice, and it is so, so good. So, hope you're trying that. Do you have the pina colada um, collagen or the unflavored? So, tell me that. So, tell me those two things. Anyway, I am just chatting with you because I hope you're off to a great start. You would have had your morning shake for breakfast. Oh, I'd love to know. Hey, just talk to me. What kind of flavor shake did you have this morning? Some of you may have chocolate. Some may vanilla. Some may add something to it to have a create a whole new flavor. Or you have the salty caramel. Um, so tell me that. Just talk to me in this chat. Um, anyway, so you had that. And then around 10 or so, you had one zing. Don't take two or you're going to be zinging. I take one zing. Um, it is about the same amount of caffeine as a cup of coffee. I had black coffee today, so it's no more than what my black coffee would have it. Or, not that we want to have Cokes, but it's just like a Coke, Coca-Cola. Um, it's actually less caffeine than a cup of coffee or a Coca-Cola. We have no issues with this. This is a natural caffeine that our body can use for energy. So, you got one zing, but you did eat it with protein. It's really good for your body to always eat things with protein. Um, so, you had that, and then you had your accelerated lunch. You had um, protein, a vegetable, and a healthy fat at lunch, and now your trim stick. So there's where we're at on our journey. Actually, I started mine this morning with my probiotic and um, my global blend. You know, I like you know I like that. Anyway, so I was just gonna um, let you know, just chat about that. Also, I am fixing it in the comment or not in the comments in this chat. I am gonna post some exercise um, ideas and tips at home, and then I want you to tell me more about the exercises you do or share stuff. Um, that is one thing, if you know me, which all of you do, you've been in my our groups, I do not like it when people say, oh, you can lose weight by just sitting on the couch. That's a diet pill. We're not about diet pills. That's starvation. We're not about starving. We're going to eat good food. We're going to supplement with natural supplements to help our body work better, but we're going to get some exercise. I'm not a crazy gym rat. I don't do CrossFit, but I do lifestyle fitness, which means I need to move my body, work my muscles, pump my heart in and out my lungs as long as I can. That is important for overall health. Walk around the block, dance in the living room, um, do yard work, push the mower instead of a riding lawn mower, um, park the farthest out at Walmart all the way to the end of the parking lot and walk in, walk around Walmart, walk in. You're getting exercise. We hear the same, take the stairs. If you've got stairs at home, run up and down the stairs a couple of times. There are so many ways that you can get exercise in during your day. And it is important 
to do it. And when you're doing it, I want you to consciously think, I'm exercising. I am moving my body. It may not be a cardio, like 20 minute ride of that, which is also great to do, but it is very important to move your body during the day. Stretch, move over your head, under. I know they so, so, sound so silly, but they only sound silly until you can't do it anymore. When you can't get up and walk, when you can't reach for something, when you can't stand up straight and tall, when you can't run around the block, that's when it's not silly anymore and you're gonna wish you did it. Anyway, that's enough of my preaching. I just wanted to pop in to let you know, stay on track. I'm sure you're doing great, keep it up. Um, tell me about your trim sticks, your shakes, your collagen. Tell me about your exercise, what you're doing. We'll chat later, but I hope you're having a great day. Bye, y'all.